Oh my god, you're so tall. You look like a giraffe. Mm, that's why you dead built like a baked bean. A baked, a baked bean. Good morning. We are headed to the fair, and this is what I'm looking like right now, but I'll show you guys the full fit in due time. I waited to put my corset and all my belts on because I'm smart, and I didn't want to be uncomfy in the car. So uh, yeah, stay tuned for that. We're going to be meeting up with some friends and taking some photos, hopefully, and I'm super excited. After yesterday, we had so much fun taking our anniversary photos, our fairy queen, and our valiant knight pictures, which will be up on Instagram and also probably on Savannah's photography page I will be linking that in both this video and the other episode as well if you guys would like to see if those photos are out by now but they should be at the time of me posting this rather than recording this all right well let's get to the fair I like this. Look. I get mad when no one calls me. That's awesome. That is good. It's very refreshing. No. Welcome to my vlog. So, I'd like to tell you about my life here. <laughs> I ran into some people. Hey! <laughs> when worlds collide, finally. Oh, that's okay. I love your eyelashes. You look so cool. I'm obsessed with everything you're wearing. <laughs> Oh! 
I would like to pet a cow. I love her. Cows. cows. Hi. Am I allowed to touch? He, he's looking for the feed though. Oh, he's like, uh, you gotta get you. those ice cream cones. You, you want to feed your leg? Your hand, your came up to me empty-handed. Yeah, he's like turning away from me. Look at that. Yeah. Such attitude. <laughs> Because I love you now. Yeah, you like that. You got a little on your snoot. You got a little on your snoot. You got a little. You got a little something right there. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Little pregnant pony. Oh yeah, there's a little pony over there. He like He doesn't care. He was a. Yeah, he was like, I don't like you earlier, but now that he knows I have food. Well, I gotta share. Okay, I gotta share. <laughs> oh, here comes the other one. Yeah. Yeah. You like that, huh? You got a little on your on your on your nose as well. Yeah. He's going for the cone. They said he will try to snap the cone. Yeah. yeah. You're a good kid. Yeah. You're a good kid. Like, do you have some for me? Sorry, I do not. Oh, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure. Yeah. I'm sorry. Oh. Oh. So, oh, no, don't chew on her wings. No, no. She oh, went for I, the... I got, uh, <laughs> it was like, are these edibles? She's like, no, no, they're not. Yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. Should, I, should I go to home? Yeah, so little, too. I don't think they're interested. Okay, well, I can just Yeah. There you go. There you go. And then you just put the cone. I guess you can feed them. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now I gotta wash my hands. Yeah, look at that. Baby slobber. Slobber. There we go. Now it's complete. No, no, it's right. Two strong and meet each other on the ground. Yes. <laughs> 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 Come here! Bring it down, bring it down. 
There you go. <gasps> what is two of you up right here? Everybody together? Yeah, and I know. You gotta document the, e the exit. Yeah. This one right up there. Yes, Mr. Oh, 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 we got some there. Oh, yeah, they don't see it happy. We just got done at the fair. We're gonna go get something to eat. I was gonna say I'm sad that it's over, but spoiler alert, this one wants to go tomorrow before we catch our flight. So uh, there might be more to this vlog. We couldn't get enough. So we have kind of a late flight and we were feeling pretty good this morning. So we are back at the fair for one more day. We don't get to stay as long because we have to drive to Denver to catch our flight and return our car, but we're gonna try to get some fun out of today. And this is the fit. I actually brought my purse this time and I didn't bring my vlog camera. I'm just using my phone just, just to make things easy so I don't have things in my hand because I drop things easily when I'm overwhelmed and track of things and I lose things, so. Richard always said, you gotta go. Go with a smile. All right, here you go, for you, the ultimate sword swallowing stunt. Here. do what I do. Oh. Folks, it's not my entire collection of swords. No, it's really not. Uh, the, uh, I actually have so many swords back at home that uh, I actually have a deal with my wife, and uh, that is every new sword that I buy, she can get another pair of shoes. <laughs> you laugh, it will happen to you. <laughs> but then I found a loophole. I became a knife thrower. <laughs> so now every new knife that I get, she just gets crocs. Give a big round of applause. I triple dog dare you. You triple dog dare me. That is right, folks. Especially you kids. Never turn down a triple dog dare ever. Unless you're a chicken. Nobody calls me chicken. All right, you can call me chicken, but nobody calls her chicken. That's for sure. All right, here we go, folks. Here. Give it up for a large lady. All right, then. Sarah, ready? Ready, side. All right, here we go. Give it up for our lords and ladies. For the rest of you that didn't laugh at that, I know what you're thinking. Oh, yeah, there's nerds here. I hate to break it to you. You're here, too. Sarah, go ahead. Roll, roll for next time. You're not the DM. Shut up. All right, 12. No, actually, you know what? Advantage. Advantage. Hey, kiddo. Here. You're giving a good pull across the stage. Just pull it across the stage. Come on. Pull it. Pull it. Oh, 14. That's better than 12. So I think we can go on with this one. Awesome job, buddy. Be here at my next game. All righty then. Well, Sarah, like since we did, uh, the kid did roll better for us. You down to add an extra little bit? Let's do it. All right. Fantastic. Lords and ladies, Sarah's going to do this one facing the board. Sarah, ready? All righty. On the hub. There we go, folks, good job. So Sarah Bonnie is going to hide behind this sheet of paper. I'm going to throw the knives. I'm going to play a little game of Schrodinger's cat. Come here, you strike me out. No, no, it's just a joke, it's just a joke. <laughs> Seriously, it's just to see how smart this audience is. Sounds like they want us to mess around and find out. For sure they do. All right, uh, pardon me as I uh, lock her into this piece of paper really quick. It's a bit of a windy day today, and uh, contrary to popular belief, I do care about my assistant here. And thus, Sarah Ray. Fantastic. Are those? Please! Not a scratch on me!
but like that. <laughs> One more. One more. Oh, that. Nice. Good job. <laughs> High five. <laughs> Now I hope you're not expecting a big expensive souvenir haul because I'm not rich. But I did pick up a few things, so let me show you what I got. First of all, I'm sure you recognize this bodice. Now pro tip, if you are a small petite adult, buy from the kids section. This is a kids or a youth bodice, which means it doesn't have boning so it's super comfy. And I got this in a size large and I'm glad I listened to my better judgment and not the shop girl who was telling me that I was an XL in their kids sizing. Because because as you can see, the large fits. Now I can't really tighten up the, the top part because I have boobs and kids do not, but I usually like a gap with my corsets anyways. So I'm almost wondering if I could have gotten a medium because this is kind of overlapping and I still have some room in the waist. Like I could, I could honestly go tighter with this. I like my bodices to be pretty tight on the waist, so. But in case you don't know, kids' Ren Faire garb is less expensive than adult Ren Faire garb. And before you're like, you're robbing those shop owners for going for the kids' sizes instead of the adults and giving them more money for practically the same product with a different label. I am not the only one that does that. In fact, one of the shop girls who was helping me was wearing one of the kids' bodices, and she was one of the ones helping me figure out what size I was. Plus, it was at a like kids-only store, like they only carry kid sizes, and out of all the shops, it was probably the least busy. There aren't a lot of kids at Ren Fairs, and the ones that are aren't usually dressed up, or they're dressed up in like Spirit of Halloween costumes. Parents don't tend to go all out for their kids for Ren Fair, so I mean, may as well give those shops some business, especially the ones that don't carry adult sizes. So if you're a small adult, don't feel bad about buying kids clothes. I find this more comfortable than a regular corset, to be honest. Like I said, the, the, the fit is a little bit, but you know, it works. And this was $40 instead of like $100. So as someone who blew all their money just to get there, I appreciate the discount. I did get a couple jewelry pieces. As you guys saw, me and my husband got some rings because it is our anniversary, or at least it was like a month ago. So, you know, we wanted to get some matching or coordinating rings, but I also got this rose necklace and I've never seen these before. This is a real rose that has been preserved in resin. But ever since I got back, I've been seeing these everywhere. I've been seeing earrings, bracelet, you know, just other rose and resin jewelry. So I find that kind of funny that I've never seen these before and now all of a sudden I'm seeing them everywhere. I also got these, and no, these are not coin pouches. These are actually wine slushy mixes. So how these work are you mix these in with your favorite wines. So one of them is blackberry, one of them is raspberry. The raspberry, in my opinion, goes best with the white wine, whereas the blackberry goes best with a sweet dessert red wine. I tried the blackberry with a white wine once and mm, it was not as good. And I think it's because the raspberry is a bit more tart when it comes to its sweetness, whereas the raspberry is more full, if that makes sense. I'm not a wine person, so I don't know terms when it comes to like 
pairing stuff, but that's just my experience. The red wine that I used for the blackberry was a Riscato, whereas the white wine that I used was just a plain, I think it was a white Moscato, both kind of on the sweeter side. And the best part is I used cheap wine instead of expensive wine and nice. it's good, it's dangerous. Lastly, this isn't really a buy because technically he does these four tips, but we did tip him, but I got a little, a little portrait. My friend that was showing us around, she got one each day, but I didn't get one the first day. I kind of wish I had because I think it'd be cute to have like a picture of me drawn with a little, I'm pointing at it right now as if you can see behind you, my little flower hat. But I did make sure I got one on the last day before we left and I was wearing my little deer antlers and my space buns. So I'm really happy with that. I'm definitely gonna frame this and put this on the wall. As vain as that might be, it is my face. But yeah, I thought this was super cute and I had to get one. A good little memento, little souvenir of the trip. So yeah, that's everything I got. I wish I had had the money to get more stuff. There was a lot of beautiful things that I really wanted to get, but going on a trip is expensive. We had like other costs, so I had to factor that in. Maybe next time I'll have the means to be able to get more. We do have some local fairs we're gonna be going to in a few months. I think the first one is probably not gonna be till October because it is hot as balls in the summer and I don't wanna die. But we are staying in a hotel or an Airbnb for that one as well. So we kind of have to pace ourselves a little bit with that too, but we will see. If you wanna support me and help me get more trinkets and more lovely things at the fair and support small businesses, um, like this video, subscribe to my channel and explore my other platforms as well. I also have channel members memberships if you would like to support me monetarily, but I won't push that on you. And pretty soon I will start doing channel member exclusive videos. I actually have quite a few on the editing, what's the word, block on the editing pipeline. I don't know. I don't know words. And my brain is a bit fried right now, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Let me know down in the comments what your favorite moment was, what your favorite fair is, just anything you'd like to talk about. Any kind of interaction that you give this video really helps it out in the algorithm. So I really appreciate that. And I really appreciate you. I love you guys so much and I can't wait to see you in the next adventure. Bye-bye.